It's going to be discovered this afternoon, but you've got to go look, you know, or you'll never find it, of course. I just want to look at the involved, even if you're not in the market. Find it. Good idea to see what the latest and, uh, you know, the design changes and so on. And in particular, in this case, the uh, Village of Penny, the brand new you know, see it. Uh, Village of Penny, uh, there's a fabulous new three-bedroom, two-bath designer, Sarasota. You can uh, find out all the new homes that are available for your inspection on the new home showcase. It's in the day and sun every day, of course. Uh, this particular one I mentioned, the three-bedroom, two-bed designer Sarasota. It's an open house from 12.30 until 2.30. It's located at 5590 Bluebird Lane. That's in the village of Benny. It's priced at $509,697. God for it. $5590 Bluebird Lane. J. Parr is there to answer any questions you have. Yamaha with Quiet Tech. When luxury, performance, and value matter, drive the innovative 2017 Yamaha powered with EFI Quiet Tech. It's the most great
rescue. Thank you, Greg. Greg will be here at uh, top of the hour right after Fox News with the uh, midday musical buffet for you. That's uh, Joe Cocker and Jennifer Warren's, of course. Love that song. All right. Now we've got a uh, beautiful afternoon other than the fact it's very, very hot. So be careful if you're out and about. Make sure you cover yourself with uh, sunscreen and because uh, you can burn very quickly. The uh, UV index is right on the verge of being extreme today. So uh, be careful. All right. Hear that? We've got, uh, at the doo-wop the hop, doo and rock. What is that? Well, tomorrow, Friday, at uh, 2 o'clock, it's excitement at the Aptigo Recreation Center. And uh, you can go, you can get up, you can have fun, you can dance tomorrow. <laughs> From the Fox Business Network, Wall Street is reviewing earnings news. Ford, Comcast, Dow Chemical, American Airlines, Health Insurer, Anthem, and Under Armour all reported better than expected numbers. There were fewer home buyers signing contracts last month. The National Association of Realtors says its pending home sales.